everyone, this is Kyle from We Tech Care Review, and today we're going to look at sharing a Power BI report with an external user and allowing them to see it using their Power BI Pro license. So they will be a guest user in your tenant, but when you share your report, they can see that using their own Power BI Pro license in their tenant. Um, so let's get started. So first things first, if you can come to portal.azure.com and you will see your Azure portal. Uh, so if you can go to Azure Active Directory and then select on users on the left. And what we want to do first is add that external guest user into our Active Directory into our tenant. So if you can select here, new guest user, invite user, And then you can put a message in if you want. But, but of course, this, this email address of this external guest user, this is the email address that the, the link will be shared to. And um, of course, this is the email address that they are expected to have the Power BI Pro license assigned to in their tent. Um, okay, so once you've filled in all that information, if you can scroll down and you can click invite. And that will send an invitation to that guest user. Okay, so I'm just switching over to the other tenant where I've just added that external guest. And as you can see, that the email I entered for that external guest has received an email which is inviting me to access their organization. So this is the We Tech Care of You tenant is inviting that external user to access their organization. Now, this is an important step is that the external user has to accept this invitation. Um, once you select accept here, it should prompt to grant access from the We Tech Care View tenant, tenant A, to the external tenant, tenant B. And here you can see, so what I will now click is click accept. So this is so the external user should select accept here. Okay, so now the user has accepted that invitation and the link between the tenants is set up. Now I'm going to share the Power BI report with that user. So what you need to do is you come into the report that you would like to share with that external user. You select share, share the report, and then just enter the name of the email address that you added for that external user. Um, once you've added that there, that should come up because it's in your Azure Active Directory and they've accepted that invitation as well. And um, you can now just share that report. Then that external user will receive an email with a link to this report. So I will just again swap back to the other tenant um, and the email should come in shortly. Okay, so now you see I've received the link. So I can open this report. And the first time that you open this report, it will still ask you to upgrade to Power BI Pro. But again, if you've got that license assigned to your account in this external tenant, you can just click not now. Um, for some reason that seems to pop up. Once you've clicked not now, uh, you can open the link again and the report will load. And there you can see, so now you can see that the, the report is now shared. Um, if I click my profile here, you can see I'm using the pro account. So I am using the pro account in this external tenant and it is not assigned to me in the We Tech Care of You tenant, even though I'm sharing this report. Um, I hope this helps everyone. Uh, I, I know I had some some sticky situations with this at first. Now I found that this way works well. Um, so I hope this helps. Please don't forget to like and subscribe the video. And uh, thank you for watching. Take care.